Every so often, you see an upcoming Metroidvania, and you do genuinely wonder, is this going to match some of the greats? Metroid, Castlevania, Ori, Hollow Knight. Eterna Noctis might be one of them. Only one way to find out. Let's go. I mean, <laughs> let's let's make this very clear. This is stylish as hell. <laughs> I love how this looks. I'm very excited to dive into this. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. In the beginning, only chaos existed, flooding all existence with his presence. In his magnificence, he created space-time and populated the vast void with infinite universes. Upon contemplating his creation, he named it Aeterna. Innumerable beings were conceived, and proud of his work, he liberated them, blessing them with free will. The passage of time corrupted his utopia. The beings he had created were hungry for power and began to destroy their own existence. As a result, two main factions were formed, light and darkness, and they went to war against each other eager to win power over Aiderna, although it belonged to neither. Outraged, Chaos cursed the leaders with immortality, obliging them to fight for eternity in the hope of maintaining the equilibrium that both were anxious to destroy. Cursed, the Queen of Light, and the King of Darkness would fight to the death for the throne of Aeterna and to restore equilibrium. The defeated monarch would come back to life, condemned to fight once more for victory and recover the power lost in battle. Chaos was pleased with himself since he had achieved the alternate reign of light and darkness, thereby establishing a perfect equilibrium until the end of time, until eternity no longer existed, until the end of all existence. Wasteland of the Fallen. Yeah, sounds about right. Once again, the never-ending story. As always, the seven fragments of the Shrine of the Kings. I have to find them and place them back on the pillars. Only then will I regain my power and ascend to the heavens again. Okay. Interesting that we are playing as the villain of sorts. Don't dislike it, though. Oh, the door's closed. What a shame. Uh, you know, is that a person? They are huge, if so. <laughs> Noted. Alright. So what can I do? Yeah, no, they are people, so I can attack with my epic sword. 
In his infinite wisdom, the Maker created the Shrine of Kings, a sacred place where the fallen monarch must put the fragments of power necessary to ascend to the heavens. The Clement Throne of Eterna forever. Fair enough. Um, I will put them there. This is a very pretty game. Anything to the left? There sure is. I'm gonna check what's over here. Ooh, we have got a thing. That's, I'm guessing, a checkpoint. And hello, little creature, you're adorable. And also, dead! Yay! <laughs> Fantastic news. We do not have a double jump. We have a singular jump, but I will hopefully not... Ugh, hello. Hopefully this will not be a problem. Yeesh. You're strong right out the bat, aren't you? Nice, okay. So far, really digging this. Um, I'm gonna assume I can't get up there. That that seems a bit too high. So I'm gonna make my way back. <laughs> Fair enough, you should have went right, you fool. <laughs> I mean, you had to check, right? I just wanted to see if that, if that uh, lantern did anything since, or lamp did anything, so that curses. <laughs> Cause uh, it was sparkling, I needed to know. What if it did do something? Wouldn't that be amazing? It doesn't, but wouldn't it have been amazing if it did? Yes! Yes, it would have! No, this game's really cool so far. Very interesting presentation. Really intriguing story. Look forward to seeing where it's going. Um, and, of course, so far, gameplay's pretty alright. Uh, but it's only gonna get better, because presumably we're gonna get more powerful as the game goes on. So, pretty exciting. Hmm, interesting. Cool dark portal. Liking it. Lovely. That's a nice checkpoint. Hello. <laughs> Shall I read these? Maybe I should read these. I don't know, but the new cycle has begun. The last time she passed through here, I could see the determination in her eyes. She was enraged too, more than expected, as she did before you, your highness, and you before her. And so, from the first of the cycle, she must regain the power lost in battle and reclaim the throne of Aetana. That is Chaos's will, one and the other. Light and dark. Cut the chatter, Keeper. I've been doing this my whole life. And all your life you will be doing it. Just like her. That's how balance is maintained in the universe. Each cycle it's the same lecture. You have just ascended into the mortal plane. You may feel dazed and confused for a while. Do you need me to remind you of the basics, King of Darkness? Sure, why not? Wise decision, your highness. Please, come with me. Oh, sure, I'll just go into the Orb of Darkness, no big deal. So, whoa, this is super pretty. Oh, I love this so much. Wow. Eterno is full of obstacles, traps, and crags, impossible for a mortal to overcome. But not for you, your highness. Press A to jump and use a raw to guide the direction of the jump. The longer you press, raw, the higher the jump will be. Noted. Can do. I did it. I did the jump button. Yeah, and I can do a tiny jump if I want. Yay, I did it. Your sword is a symbol of poise and lethality. It has accompanied you in battle since before the wrath of chaos fell on your shoulders. I know. Defeat the slime. Press X to attack and use ah to direct the sword. I don't know why I'm going ah each time, but it's entertaining. So, it's entertaining me at least. So we got some coin. <laughs> That's not massively dissimilar from the noise I made when I was talking about directionals. So you know, use the ah to die. You know, as you as you do. You can perform a downward attack by pressing A in the air, X plus the A. This will allow you to bounce off enemies in some surfaces like the spheres below. Gotcha. Yes. Knew it. Glorious. 
you do that, you won't experience the ah. Uh, some platforms can be traversed upwards using A. Nice, nice, nice. Soy funny, si so Potions like this will allow me to heal, to instantly recover a heart by pressing up. They only have one use. If I drink them, I have to find more. So when you say one use, you say just a heart, as in one heart or multiple. Probably wants to use it now, but also probably definitely doesn't have a platform to like the send. Yeah, they do. Use uh, to move the camera. Excellent. That is helpful. I appreciate it. I love the floor. It's so cool. You never disappoint your highness. Evidently. Cross the door. I'll see you later. Great. Nice. We've got an achievement saying you are prepared. If I'd skip that tutorial, I wouldn't have got that achievement. It was totally worth it. Let's go. One thing we didn't check. Can I downward slash on, uh, like, spikes and stuff? I can do it on enemies, but can I do it on, something, on stuff that's more lethal? So far, we do not yet know. I guess we'll find out over time. Anything through here? Any secrets to be found? You never know. Oh, okay, so you can only hold one of these at a time, it seems. Yeah, okay. So you can only hold one at a time, and it only does heal one heart. Okay, that is great to know. So if you see another one, there's no reason not to use the one you've currently got, unless you're at full health already. Okay, good. Yeah, absolutely not going up there near you. Why, why would I? That's You're terrifying. I will attack you through the floor, thank you. Yeah, I don't know how difficult this game is going to be yet. I'm expecting it to be tough. Oh, look at these, like... I thought... Honestly, I thought... I, I don't know why, I just saw, like, legs instead of, like, a robe, and I thought it was, like, a UFO spider. <laughs> I think I saw, like, the bit of the flagpole and thought it was a leg. <laughs> like, whoa, look at these UFO spiders. No, no. Um, the spirits of those defeated in battle dwell in this cursed land. Their wandering souls roam these plains, forever lamenting their lack of skill in the battlefield. Rad. <laughs> yeah, I can't even notice that I'm getting, like, a percentage each time I kill something. Very much intrigued to see what that means. I think one more kill will do it. Okay, intriguing. Skill point obtained. Oh, okay. Oh, that's an interesting way to garner skill points. Okay, so that's your level up. Right, I, I like I like it actually, like, showing a percentage as opposed to just, like, a number. That's actually really cool. Um, so, can we see our skill points? Um, perks. So we have one left. All right, let's see. No damage increased by 10%. That's very handy. Critical damage, not necessary yet. Increase critical strike. That one it is. <laughs> like, 100%. So let's see. Attracts dogmas when they are around you. Okay. I don't know what that is yet, but it sounds like that bod mass math thing. I know it's not that. Um, it's charged, more damage, melee damage. Okay, and then it's locked mind stuff. Increase the amount of dogmas when defeating enemies. That's really handy if that's the currency. Um, okay, there's some, there's some cool stuff here. Yeah, definitely, for sure. And what's that one? Also, yeah, I'm thinking of going for this and then those. Because, yeah, it's, that costs two, but it's definitely worth it. Um, gems. So these are your charms, essentially. And it seems like you can eventually hold up to six, which is very handy. Liking that. There's a lot going on here. <laughs> Boy, there is a lot going on. So there's no turning back. Seven fragments, cast land you cycle. Man, this is really cool. Whoa, look at this map. Okay, so can I zoom out? Whoa. Yeah, I sure can. World map. Oh, boy. Yeah, no, this is... There, there's a lot of uh, reasons to sort of, like, compare it to Hollow Knight. It's clearly inspired by it in certain aspects. The map, I can certainly see, like, it being inspired by it. Uh, the charm system might be somewhat similar to a degree. Um, but, no, overall, this is really cool. I really like this. Oh, fragment obtained. Oh, you get more fragments, you get... Ah, okay. Fragment of heart. Every time I collect three, I'll get an additional health point. Yeah, okay, yeah, I gotcha. This game, so far, real good. 
And like, obviously, we're we're not even at like anything like special yet. Like, no, not to. What if I use? I wanna. I don't wanna use my thing because that's a different. That's a blue one instead of a red one. I wonder if that's any like drastically different. Um, but yeah. Whoops. Uh, yeah, no, I'm really digging this. I suspect this game's gonna get real harder points. It's gonna have some really cool bosses. It's gonna have really cool abilities that we're gonna learn. Like, yeah, just cool stuff. And I really like... Oh, that's kind of neat. Uh, I really like the idea of actually, like, getting experience. Like, that's... I don't know, it's just... It's simple, but it's really good. Like, this is one of the many thrones that you will find throughout your adventure. You can use them to restore your health, and it will serve as a link between different territories of Eterna. Of Eterna, sorry. Finally, when you sit on the pressing B, you can access the experience menu. Do so by pressing ah. Uh. Here you can improve your skills and reset them if you deem it necessary. Try it out now and spend the skill points you've acquired by killing your enemies. Imagine if you hadn't got any skill points, you just didn't kill any. That would be a tragedy. I will enjoy my throne, thank you very much. So as it turns out, I didn't actually need to do that. Uh, I've already used my thing. Um, but no, I like this. Whoa, that is sick. <laughs> Right. That is so badass. I love that. I really love that. So what does Legend do? Oh, okay, so statistics. Oh, this is really cool. There's a lot going on here. This game is not messing around. Oh, okay, you're just telling me why I already know. Okay, cool, cool. Oh, that was a mistake. <laughs> you know that throne? Yeah, let's sit back on that throne. Mm. Ah, good stuff. Did enjoy it, yeah, cool. Yeah, I I just sort of, you know, didn't jump. It's fine, it happens. Yeah, no, this is this is cool. Oof. I mean it's it's great to have another Metrovania. I mean there are quite a lot that do get made nowadays. Um but it is a very high quality one so far. And you know, the wait for Silk Song. Is a long one, so <laughs> yes, I can't but notice this is definitely a secret. It certainly feels like it, right? But I'm not getting up there just yet because I don't have like a double jump or something. Yeah, I mean you can maybe a wall jump actually, but yeah, that's cool. Okay, that looks fun. I think we're seeing already that there's going to be some tough platforming. I remember seeing in the trailer a while back that there was some, like, really, really difficult stuff, like White Palace level stuff. So, you know, good. we'll be good. Looking forward to it. So what's that one? Okay, so that's... Okay, the blue one is still the same health potion, I think. Okay. I just thought it was different because it was blue and not red. But I, I see. Is there anything through here that I can do? No. Doesn't look like it. Hello. Before continuing, you must meet an old acquaintance in the Temple of the Kings. That's great. But I won't go there on foot. Of course not, your highness. I myself will transport you there. Sweet. Thank you. Appreciate it. Well, this place is pleasant so far. Yay! Yeah, I'm just gonna have a nice little nap. Enjoy my throne. The art style is gorgeous. It really is. Yoink, hello. That's some good stuff. That's a lot of money. Yeah, that's 400. Mm, not bad. Okay, so that's a dead end for now. And on the right side, what can I expect? Can I expect more treasures for me? I can expect an old man. Hello, old man. I've just finished writing down your farewell with the keeper. Let me finish the paragraph in which you open that door. Chronicle. It is always a pleasure to see you again. Meetings, old friend. I was already beginning to miss that sharp personality of yours. Don't call me the King of Darkness by chance. 
Oh, uh, yes. You remember your own name. I perfectly remember the first time I wrote it. I think it was in the volume number. Uh, I've just hit the ground, but now I have to regain all my power. Don't screw it up for me so soon. Oh, pardon my rambling. You know me, I can't help it. I'm in love with my job. The entrance to the Temple of the Kings is further ahead. There you will find the ten doors you opened last time. Now they are shielded, as is usual every time a new cycle begins. Take the first key. The other nine are lost all over Iterna. Come back whenever you find one of them to face a new challenge. Good luck, my friend. I won't be long until you find me coming. Oh, sorry. It won't be long until you find Why? I, yeah. I just entirely misread how that was going to go. Sight reading. It can either work or it will fail miserably. <laughs> like... So, I get a key, I do a challenge. Cool. Can do. Your Highness, welcome to the Temple of the Kings. When a cursed king is defeated, part of their power is sealed behind the... I know, I've done this a billion times! We, I, I, I could expect him to, like, get just very angry with, with death, you know? We've got their power to us claimed again. I'm a self-taught expert spell on this keeper. You can leave me alone. Then go ahead, use the key the Chronicler gave you and open the first door. Inside you will find a fragment of your power. Gl gladly, then. I was thinking, what's to stop you from coming back after you got all ten keys and do it then? But I suspect this is, yeah, this is probably going to give you a new ability. Climbing again? <sighs> he losing my powers. All right, that's like a warp pad back, I guess. This is really cool. Ah, okay. Neat. Okay. I like this a lot. Oh, there's something up there. Although I suspect that's where we'll be going from, I guess. We'll, we'll go there and we'll collect it on the descent. That's a platform, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> it wasn't... Oh, it disappeared. Right, I was going to say, I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, that makes sense. This is really cool. I don't know, this game just has a really good vibe. Oh! Oh, that's, no, that's like super death. Right, okay, yeah. Cool, gotcha, gotcha. I'm dead. Yeah, I knew I messed up when I did it. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Do I want to go down first, or... I don't know, maybe not. Whatever's up here's gotta be worth it. Yeah, up here is worth it. What is this? Hello! Rad. Perhaps a dash or something? At last! So he's tired of moving like a simple mortal. Now that I've regained my ability, I'll be able to move faster. Reach greater distances. And yeah, be much more lethal in combat. Also, if I jump or dash when an, uh, just when an enemy hits me, I'll avoid being stunned and will be able to move freely. By pressing RT, I'll be able to use the ability I, ju I just... Okay, so I can stop this ability that's in progress. Direction. Okay. So it is a dash, right? Yes, absolutely a dash. Whee! Nice. Whoa! Okay, but there was a thing. Yes, each new will become more powerful. I must remind you one more thing at the library. It'll teleport you there. No, no, don't tell him over here. There was a thing. There was an item. I wanted to get the item. You. Why did you do this? Well, I'm going back in. King of Darkness. The thrones fulfill one last duty. Through them, you can quickly travel to any other one that you've already visited. Sit down by pressing B and use Err to open the map. Press X to see available locations. You can select the throne you want to go to by pressing A. Use this one to return to the wasteland of the Fallen and continue your journey. What about my Puddle of Darkness? It's one of my most useful skills, and I have no dimensional vial. Here you have one. With it, you can use the Portal of Darkness to return to the last throne you have visited, 
And if you press uh, for a few seconds. Oh, okay, that's handy. Remember, but this dimensional vial has one single use. Okay. You say you have to recharge over time. Got it. As you helpful as ever, Keeper. Farewell, Your Highness. Good luck, and may the darkness will move right turn on again. I do like the idea of trying to bring darkness back to the land. That's kind of amazing. Whee, that is very fast, I like. Yeah, no, we're going back in there. There was a thing. I need that thing. I can't go back in. Right, yes, I absolutely can. Good. I was saying, I better be able to. I'm getting the item. I know how to get it, more or less. I could use that, or I could simply dash. Yeah, I want to go up. I want to go up there. Oh, I like that you can cancel out the dash, though. Like, it's, it's a fixed dash, but it also technically isn't. That's really good. So that's what it meant by that. Okay, I understand. That's really cool. Yeah, that's a very powerful dash then. Because, yeah, you can you can double back on yourself and completely cancel it. Hmm, interesting. Clever moveset. Uh, oh, not as easy as it looks. Alright, this might be a challenge. Getting a little antsy. Are we going to get our first game over? Possibly. Yep. <laughs> oh. I hate this. I've lost a fragment of my soul in the place where I died. I want my accumulated experience and being able to... Of storing more, I will have to recover it. Okay, so yes, that's how it works. Okay. Hey, we just needed to work out how it works. There you go. This is a fragment of the soul mirror. Its reflection shows what a monarch yearns from deep within their soul. The entrance to mirror soul is in famished to the town. I should stop by. Okay, so. I need to understand what just happened. Am I right in thinking I have no money and no experience? No, I still do. I think. I don't know how I reclaimed my soul. Maybe it just doesn't happen here because it's a like different scenario. You're in like a tutorial area. Um of sorts. I'm going to the top anyway just to make sure there's not like a soul up top that I need to collect, just in case. Because what if there is and I'm not aware of it? That would be very unfortunate. Yeah, because it's very easy to get up here now. Which is great. Yoink. Yeah, I don't think there is anything up here. Okay. I just needed to double check, because, you know, what if there was? Okay. So, yeah, I think I've got it. So, that's that done, I guess. Yeah, I do still have my money and my stuff. So, there's ten, right? Just want to make sure there's nothing at the end of here. Like a secret or something. What was whatever this is. Ha, <laughs> that's cool actually. I quite like that. Alright, that's nice. Lesson learned. So yeah, it's gonna it's gonna work the same. So if I die, return to where I died to get my stuff back. Gotcha. Fair enough. So I can go to Okay, so fast travel I can go to there or I want to go to that one, I think. That's where I was. Where I should probably keep going. Oh. Oh, I got, like, a ton of experience because I beat the area. Okay, that's kind of cool. Um, so, I guess I want to go for that, right? Unless I can only get to it from above. But I don't see why that would be the case. This way has extra melee damage, though. 
but I do want that, so I'm going for this. Alright then. Well, that was nearly close. Yeah, I do like that there is a genuine incentive to fight enemies. Like, in some games, you're just like, well, I, uh, unless you want health or whatever, like, no, there's no reason to ever fight enemies anymore, like, and too powerful, whatever. But no, here, actually, there is a very, very good reason to keep fighting enemies. Unfortunately, I still won't be able to go into the section down below, because my problem is I need a... Oh, no, I need a double jump or something of that. Uh, something like that. So, we'll just keep going this way and see what's over here. Hello, giant spider. You do not scare me. The things in the background do, but, uh, oh, this is cool. Hello. Hi. Okay, that is super cool. Well, in we go, I guess. Eastern path, Root of Souls. My favorite route. Ah, oh, the good old Root of Souls. I've got so many trainers, you have no idea. I'm gonna get my Reebok, my Nike, my Air Jordans. All of them here on the Root of Souls. All of them have souls. So uh, let's head into a new room after my truly awful set of jokes. Well, it's good that we found the secluded place. If it's a palace, um, do you reckon that's a platform I can stand on? Yeah, it disappears. Right. <laughs> Should have worked that out in hindsight. Oh no! Oh, that's not good. I don't have a healing item, do I? I do not. All right. It's fine. I just need to nail it. I did not nail it. <laughs> Okay, okay, so I've still got my money, but I've lost my experience. Right, 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 right. And do I have to fight it? No, I just have to walk into it. Okay. Gotcha. That's quite fair, honestly. Okay, I understand how this works now. Yeah, now that is... Oh, hello. You are super cool. Terrifying, sure, but super, super cool. Kinda hoping you were gonna drop some health, but I'll take it. Wow, okay, yeah, no, this is not messing around already. This is, this is really awesome. Hello, money. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what the money will be used to buy in this game. Why did I do it like that? Why did I try it like that? That was obviously never gonna work. Do the enemies return? Yes, they do. Okay, that's what I wanted to know. Whoops, you see that? Okay, so that is good to learn immediately. Not easy. Okay. Oh boy, yeah, no, really. You're not making this easy. Got it. Skill point obtained. Oh, no, it just opens that. Okay. So when you say skill point, oh, I was in one of these. Like, you literally just get a skill point. Right, okay. Fascinating. Damn it. <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm bad at jumping in this game. I'll get better when the game becomes so um, impossibly brutal. I have to get better. <laughs> now I know there's a person I want to speak to there. I kind of want to explore over here first. And I definitely shouldn't be doing this. I should definitely speak to that person first. Yeah, I'm going to speak to that person first. <laughs> Change my mind. Ah, blessed for be chaos. For an instant, I thought my glasses were fooling me. The King of Darkness himself! I am not worthy to be in your presence. Excuse me. I love to be congratulated, but 
Turn up at Dubby Dega. Who are you, old man? Lord Drake the Sixth at your service. Archaeologist, historian, lover of lost civilizations. It's a word I can't say today. Oh, oh. You don't know how much I envy you. You have lived in so many eras. You have witnessed the rise and fall of so many empires. Please. Don't. I have so many questions for you. Not on your life. I'm not a talking encyclopedia. Uh, sorry, your highness. I've been carried away by enthusiasm. If you would only help me solve a little doubt that worries me. Okay, anything for my fans. But only once. Is it true that gems of power can be embedded in your armor? Yes. My breastplate has several clefts to embed gems and even to be even more powerful. Unfortunately, with each new cycle, I lose my powers and that influences my battle gear. The armor loses all but, uh, but one cleft and the gems I it possessed disappear. Wonderful! And is it true that you can carry as many gems as you want? Almost. I can carry three common and one high power. I also like to reserve two clefts for gems of darkness. So that's true. The scriptures that I came across in my travels suggested that even the power of the King of Darkness had a limit. I thought I told you just one question. Oh! Uh, I, I am sorry, Your Highness. You don't talk to a cursed monarch every day. As a token of my regret, I will tell you that in addition to exploring, I am also an expert cartographer. Cartographer, you say? I keep maps of all the territories that I have explored. Besides valuable information about very interesting places and relics. I even hold alchemy instruments. I recently found a gadget that transforms the space-time web. It has the ability to condense dimensional energy and make new vials. It can also reveal to you interesting locations in the area where we are, such as thrones. Huh, great. Give me all the information you have. Fabulous! I would have thought that I would collect for the very royal coffers. Wait, are you going to charge me for this? Me? Excuse the misunderstanding, your highness. Archaeology is a very expensive profession. You greedy. <laughs> That's why I like you so much. If you ever need help, I will be happy to serve you. Not like that merchant in famished town. What are you talking about? Was there recently I didn't see any stores open. That is salesman who did not want to open the door of his business to me. Imagine having a store in such a central location and ignoring your customers. Anyway, amateurs, one last request, your highness, accept this gem as a token of my admiration for you. It would be an honor if you wear it at some point. You just have to go to the gem menu and select the one that I have given you. Gifts. The king will never refuse a gift. Proceed. How can I help you, king of darkness? Look, oh, the gem light alloy, it seems. Okay, so, region map, whoa. Location of all the secrets in this area. That's really cool. Okay. So that's the region map. Uh, fill a dimensional vial. That's handy. Like that. Health potion is also good. Red marker, green marker, blue marker. Okay, so. That's handy. Uh, I'm going to get the region map for now. Uh, thank you. Interested in any of my wares. So. I'm going to buy one of these. I want to know if it la it says it contains up to four. Does that mean I buy four or I can buy up to four? I think it means I get four. Okay. Well, maybe not. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Um, the Knowledge Atlas is super good. That's definitely something I want to get. Um, so let's see. Um, the world map is there. Okay, so that's good, but I can't help but notice you did not tell me anything about the map. Interesting. Oh, well, gems. So, I got a gem. That's what I got. Um, Kushi, yes, please. I will put it on. How do I quit? I... Oh, maybe I have to be sitting down. I probably have to be sitting down. Okay, that makes sense. I'm, I just realized how close to death I am. It's fine. Perfect health potion. This is why I didn't buy one. Because you can find them. Not easily, but you know. Okay, maybe I can get them easily. Maybe I'll, I'll take it back. 
Well, I'm pretty much got a lot of the money back. I think that chest is there, so in case you haven't found the chest somehow, the game's just like, here you go. <laughs> like, you've earned this. The wasteland is not the end. Those who prove themselves worthy will be blessed with a second chance, but few have overcome the horrors behind these walls and come back to life. Okay, so that's the way to go, clearly. But I want to check down here, and I want to check to the left as well. Because both ways lead to things. So let's see what we got. I mean, in many ways, it's not a bad idea to die if you're low on health, because I would, like, just restore myself right here. The downside to these spiders killing themselves... Oh, no, I was going to say, I'm not getting any items. Oh, merchant key, so that, I think, will allow me to get inside the door in the first area. Okay, that's good to know. So, can I see all this now? No. I don't understand why I can't. Can I equip this now? I can. There we go. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Gotcha. Right, I don't want to fast travel just yet, because there was a thing to the left of the cartographer that I want to check out. Oh, interesting. Even just sitting on this restores these enemies. I didn't realise it would be that quick. But, I mean, I guess it makes sense. Oh, yeah, I saw that coming. Yeah, this this is going well. Alright, cool. Okay, so. Can I get this? I can! Good stuff. Can I get the money? Yes! Some of it. Okay. So the spikes were a bit too far away, but yes, that is indeed what that does. That's good. Okay, so I'm definitely going to try and go for the item that increases the money you get. Because it's very apparent very quickly that that is super valuable. Did it say specifically from enemies? Yes, it said from enemies. Okay, I just wanted to double check because if it was in general, that's even more powerful because I could get way more from chests. Um, but no, it's just enemies. I mean, that's still really good. I mean, like, I got five there. I would have got an extra, like, one or two. So, you know, that's, that's good. Every little helps. There's going to be a, a seat up here, isn't there? No, there is not. Okay. I was going to say, like, is it... Was I going to be, like, five spaces away from reaching some health this whole time? No, I was spaces away from reaching a fragment. That's just as good. What's that here? Oh, that's how I would get back. Right, right, right. Okay, gotcha. Well, I guess it was a mistake to come back down here. Eh, I mean, not really. It, it can't hurt, can it? It wasn't the biggest journey. Yeah, I mean, you're right there. So, okay. Right. So, I obviously want to go to the right, because that's where we need to go. But, I want to go back to the beginning, because the merchant... I have the key for that, and I want to see where that leads. So, let's find out. It's very exciting. Uh, fast travel. I guess it would be that one. I don't think it's right at the beginning, but I think it's close. Oh, maybe it is right at the beginning. Okay, never mind. I take it back. It is right at the beginning. Cool. It's this, right? Hello? Out there, someone true? Can you help me? Yes? I can grieve you hearing. Please, the good Asna needs your help. I lost Storky while exploring cave east of Famish Town. Now I can't leave Stor! It is not safe to leave the town if you do not know how to wield a sword. <laughs> As there is smart, he knew someone out there. What were you doing so far from your store? Find new items to sell, yes. If Asna has new items, new customers come to Asna. If it's good for me, it's good for you. Please go east and find Storky, I beg you! I found your key. Ooh, you have saved business of good Asna! Very much, thank you. Open door and go into store, yes? Okay. I like that you get loads of experience and money for, like, just completing a quest. That's really cool. This store is rad. There's the Infinity Gauntlet. Uh, there's a pirate hat. You know, there's the Eye of Sauron up there. Cool. Good stuff. Good stuff. There's a terrifying face next to an ocarina up top right. Cool. Alright. So, uh, what do you got? 
worse than Aduma, Kitaro Mio. The wasteland of the fallen is emptier than usual. A very sad story, yes. In old days, customers fight for entering in store. Now, very few buy from good as now. But not all bad. You the only merchant left in Famished Town? Yes, and that's good, yes! Good Asna is the only merchant in town. Customers will buy only buy from Good Asna. If good for me, good for you, Dark King. It's the King of Darkness, actually. Anyway, what do you have for sale? Everything the Dark King will need. Not shy, take a look at Good King Good Asna's store. Okay. Ooh, this is good. Fusil for reactive gems of power, okay. Pure magnetite. Increases the range of speed of magnets. Attract. That is good. Tal rail system ticket. Pfft. Jeez, that's really good. Whoa, that's really good. Expensive, but incredible. Yeah, you want that. Gem slot, that's really good. Runs to dimensional vial. Dimensional Vial is not as good as others. I'm getting that because I have two, so I think that'll be good. Wise choice indeed. Yes, hello, more health. Bra! Glorious. Okay, so. The one I want the most is that. Because that is incredibly valuable. Like, the second I get that... Whoa, I moved really fast. Uh, the second I get that, the rest sort of fall into place. Um... Like, I'm just going to get more experience, more skill points, more everything. So that's super good. Um, yeah. Very tempting indeed. Oh, okay, wait. I have to go into the menu to walk. Okay, cool, cool. Um, yeah, that is fantastic. I am extremely tempted to grind for that. Like, there is technically... Nothing to stop me actually grinding for gold. Apart from the fact that realistically it would take ages. <laughs> but if I really, really wanted to, I could grind 75,000. Oh, for sure. It would take me hours at this stage in the game. I'm going to presume later on, like, enemies are just going to give me 100 a pot. But, you know. Still, it's just interesting. I like the uh, like the slowdown um, when you're about to be hit. I guess the slowdown is your like indication for like dash, get out of the way. You can you still got time, uh, which I really like. There's there's a lot of really good mechanics at play. Some of them really subtle, some of them not. But yeah, just it's it's good. This game's real good. Oh really? There's not a secret in the belly of the beast. Disappointing. Yeah, no, this this game is cool for sure. I really, really like it. I have a suspicion this is gonna become a classic. Like genuinely. Yeah, I kinda of noticed that the teeth here. Yeah, looks good. The devourer awaits patiently in its tower for the arrival of brave souls to feed on them and condemn them to a world of eternal horror. Great, okay. Looking forward to this. If there's a seat anywhere close, guaranteed it's because the devourer is here. Uh-huh. Yeah, in that room, I'm guessing. Okay, so there's a chest and then there's a devourer. Maybe there will be a room of solitude for me to take a breather. Other than that, the time must come. This game is awesome. I love that it showed you the whole tower as well. Like, that is that is a sexy thing. Like, when a game is confident enough to be like, no, nah, we can show you this. We know you're not going to, like, fully remember the path, but, you know, we'll, we'll show you. We're going to teach you what you got. Like, I love stuff like that. It's very satisfying. This game's, like, just systems that it has in place are just so fun. Like, fighting enemies in this game is good. Um, as it is in Hollow Knight. And, of course, like, you, you do have a reason to fight enemies in Hollow Knight. You get Geo and stuff. But, like, I don't know. Something about, like, getting experience just makes it feel more worthwhile. Um, and I just, I just really like the experience system. I like it doing, being done in percentages instead of just base numbers. I mean, it is still base numbers at the end of the day. And there is actually, like, you can see the base numbers in the, uh, in the menu, which is cool. Whoops. Hmm. 
yes, this is a problem. <laughs> I do have some health, so I can, I can, I can heal quickly. Good. But no, I just, I really, I really like what this game's doing. I hope that uh, loads of people discover it and it does get like very popular because yeah, it is fantastic. Well, thanks for the potion. Sorry for that spider, I guess. I'm not that sorry, but you know, it's nice to be nice. Money, please. Thank you. Really glad I got the magnet. Like, <laughs> really, really glad. I have a suspicion all that money would have gone straight downside. Oh boy, the eastern wall. Floor six. Wow, this is cool. This is really cool. This, this is less cool. The, uh, the, the smelly rotting that's uh, at my face. Yeah, not, not as not as jazzed about seeing the rot, but uh, there was a lot of things I could have done differently there. Uh, all of them I did not do. <laughs> yeah, again, I could have dodged that. I, I didn't. There's a thing down there I wanted. Yes, hello. What have we got here? Money! Where's safe? Here's safe. I say that, knowing full well you are here! Ah, oh, damn. I mean, I knew I was gonna die. It was inevitable. But that's fine, I can get back, back there quite easily, I think. I like that regardless, you keep all the money. That's actually a really good idea. Um, because, yeah, like, you're gonna need it. <laughs> I got a health potion, which is nice. I'm clearly very bad at uh, jumping in this game. I don't know what it is about it. Ah! Clever spider. Okay, handy. You are scary. I'll take that, thank you. Oh, it's the enemy itself that holds it. Right! I didn't realise that. That's actually very cool. And we got a skill point. Nice. Oh. Oh! I got my health back. Oh, wait, no, that makes sense. Yeah, no, no. I'm being silly. Sorry. I haven't checked to see if I can dash through enemies. I should really check that. Because that might be a feature. Whoops. Ugh. Oh, these enemies are super cool. So what did that? Ah, oh, that's neat. Okay, so that does that. What's to the left though? Left, I think, is the way to go. I'm gonna check this out. This is clearly more of a secret. Sure is. What is that? Soul mirror fragment. Oh, okay. I like that um, it sort of has like a Celeste element. Like like the strawberries in that game, you, you can get it, but only like once you've gone a certain distance away. That's cool. I like that a lot. So, what's down here? Down here is the way to go. It's more floor five. Yeah, oh, I don't like the eyes. Oh my gosh. That is creepy. Oh my word. Okay. I mean, it's amazing, but also, nah. <laughs> this is the way to a secret. I'm going for it. Is it a way to a secret? I just slip back to the floor six. Oh, I think it's just a shortcut back to where we were. I don't know why you'd want that though. Yeah, it totally is to shortcut back. Yeah, I don't know why you would want that. Oh well, I mean it's not a bad thing. I'm not gonna complain. Ugh, you came a lot closer than I thought you were going to. That's my bad. This is very cool. 
Oh, actually, we got a skill point, right? Money. Give me money. I want more money! Yeah, definitely worth it. Like, even these enemies are giving me a little bit more than I was getting. So, how do I get there? From above, maybe? I think so. Yeah, don't expect all the videos to be this long. I just figured that we should at least get to what I presume is the first boss. I, I think that's what's coming up, at least. I mean, I could be wrong. Okay, we have been here. Cool. But we haven't been down here. I think this is where that chest is. Yeah, it definitely is. Nice. Totally worth it. Is it always going to give you money from a chest? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Only time will tell. That is a dead end. What is this? <laughs> this is awesome. Okay. I did that badly. I think that would have worked. I just did it badly, so... Or I could do this. Yeah, that's much safer. Okay, never mind. And the thing is, as the game goes on, I'm just going to learn how to control it more. So, we'll make mistakes now and ask questions later. Right, that's... I'm going to try something. Oh, it could definitely work. That, that will work if I time it incredibly well. Or maybe there's a switch. I reckon there's also a switch up there. I gotta try it. I've gotta. I've gotta try it. I mean, the thing is, if I die, I just kill the bat again. It's not a big deal. Ah, oh, I tried. Yeah, fair enough. Ah, uh, yeah, no, I tried. It's very hard to do it, but yeah, I bet you could do it. That's probably how you're supposed to. Um, but for now, let's just mess around with the... Yeah, I think actually that is 100% how you're supposed to do that. Oh no! My dash wouldn't work. That was unfortunate. Oh well. Well, we know how to do this. This is definitely the solution. I'm not doing it well, but this is how we're going to do it. Oof, come on. I just need to get used to it. Like, this is... This game is asking some fairly challenging... Ah, oh, damn it. Fairly challenging things immediately. And that's not a bad thing at all. I love it. But it... You do just need to get into the rhythm of how the game... Ah, curses. How the game feels. Um... Ah, oh, man! Like, yeah, like, I understand how to cancel out my dash, but I need to learn specifically how to do it precisely. There we go. Totally worth it. Thank you for the hard fragment. Okay, so that's a shortcut back. Good to know. Okay, can I get back up like this? Yes, I can. And would the bat return? The bat did not return. Hear me out. Oh no, I cannot believe this has happened. I can't believe I let these spiders kill me. Oh no, it is the greatest tragedy to befall our land. Okay. You are quite high up now. Oh boy. Yeah, no, this is this is gonna be really finicky. 
Because the game clearly wants you to come back and get it when you have a double jump. But I could absolutely do it now. <laughs> like, and I want to do it now. Oh, so close. The great thing is there is no punishment for death, technically. Technically. On an extreme technicality. Yes! There it is! Oh, okay, that's just mouth. I mean, I'll take it. <laughs> For a second, I thought it was something else. But there, there you go. Knew it was possible. Just took a couple of attempts. Lovely stuff. Hello, friend. I really did a good job at avoiding you, didn't I? Uh, yeah, there's a fun blob up there. Actually, there's a chest up there. So I guess this is the secret path. Actually, that might not be true. There's also a checkpoint. Yeah, this might not be true. This might be the way to go. Uh, I'm gonna go right then. Because that's the exit, seemingly. Oh, wait a minute. Huh. <laughs> I don't know which is the real way. This looks like the secret way! Hello. Based on the location of that mirror shard. Oh, but there's also... Oh, man. Which way do I go? I don't know. Whoa, this is rad. Oh, this is super cool. Oh. Wow, okay. Oh, okay. You're not messing around. Yeah, this is why it taught you how to jump properly. This is fascinating. That was so cool. This is also cool. Yeah, I thought that's what was going to happen. I wasn't sure, though. Uh, are you going to go up as well? Oh, yeah, good. I was going to say, like, I hope so, because if not, I'm dead, so that's fun. Oh, what have I done? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I misinterpreted what was happening. This is not easy. Oh, I misinterpreted it. I, I freaked out. Oh, actually. Um... Well, that kind of works. Right. The problem I have is how do I get that? Oh, no. Oh, I have to come back the long way now. Oh, okay. Where does that put me? I have no idea. I can take a guess. Floor three. Were we in floor four before? I don't know. Yes, I think we were. Am I right in thinking if I go up here will be where that chest was. Yes. Okay. Cool. That's what I thought. Right. I'm getting that mirror shard. But can you? Ah, uh, that's the thing. I don't know if you can, actually. Because, like... Look at the room for a second. Think about it. Like... How do you get enough height? There's nothing to, like, jump off of to get to it, even as, like, a sacrifice of health. I will come back. Just because, actually, I'm not sure if that is possible yet. And maybe it is. Maybe it's, there's something I'm missing. Um, but I, I'd rather not spend half an hour trying when I could very easily come back in, say, an hour with a double jump and just get it instantly. Sure, I'd have to make it through the previous floors, but let's be real, that does not take a lot. So that's... that's cool. I like that. Nice. There we go. I didn't see what floor are we on. Three, right? I think. Yeah, that enemy's cool. Right. Ugh. 
Where are you? Yeah, killing me. Nice. Oh, I don't have any health. Okay, I thought I did. Ah! I thought you were the other one. Did you die? No. <laughs> I didn't know if you had a limit or not. You do. Great. Cool. Good stuff. All right. I keep seeing, like, the flying pieces of <laughs> And thinking that it's, uh, like, something that's about to try and hurt me. Oh, interesting. I immediately got my percentage back. I think that's a glitch. Oh, no. Well, yes and no. I've lost one of my, like, top left. You can see it's shattered. Interesting. That is interesting. Okay. Very much like Hollow Knight. I mean, if you're gonna copy any Metroidvania, the best is a good place to start. <laughs> like... You have my face. I did a real good job avoiding you. So. Welcome to more platforming. I enjoy it. Oh, this is cool. I like this. Nope. <laughs> How to really badly screw up. Oh, that. I, I couldn't have done much worse. Like, that was up there. Oh, attacking cancels you out of it as well. At least it can do. Injure well, attacking and hitting something. Oh, you want me to go back, do you? Yes, I see that. Okay. Oh. Oh, I didn't realize I opened that floor as well. Okay. Oh, that's fine then. <laughs> hmm. This must be the key that opens the door. Is there any one way to find out? Right, okay, so I found the key, which is great. Boss time? I think so. Oh no! I don't like it! Oh, it's horrible! Oh my god! I mean, it's amazing, sure, but oh my god. This is awesome. Ah, oh, that was lucky. Oh, no. Okay, we're fine. This is a really cool boss fight. Okay, I think that was a good solid start. What are you doing next? You are horrifying. Absolutely horrifying. Please die. Uh, uh, are they all hurting me? Uh, yes, they can all hurt me. Okay, just to clarify. Just so on the same page here. Yes. This will destroy me. Ugh. Oh, you dropped health. I just realized that. Great, I'll take more then. I didn't realize you would, but that's very kind of you. Are we back onto the first type of attack? You Nope, we on. What is this? You're not messing around for the first boss, are you? See what we're doing. This is really cool. Oh Jesus! Oh, I'm very close to death. Can I attack these? No, I can't. Okay, just so we're clear on that. Give it health. <laughs> okay. Are you close to death for any chance? Thank you. Would like more health, but I can't really afford it. Ah, oh, I tried to get out. Okay. Not easy at all, actually. Very, very hard. But this is awesome. I love this fight. Let's go. Okay, I, I understand more of what you're doing now. That's terrifying, though. Like, really. Oh, it's so cool. Okay. Ugh. That's a hard attack to dodge. So 
So you're doing the circular thing, right? Yes, you are. In many ways, it's just good to avoid it. Jeez, oh, it's hard to avoid, though. To say it's not would be a lie. Uh, I'm almost certainly dead. Yeah, this is real hard. I will win, obviously. But yeah, no, that attack, I don't know why. I My brain can't really fathom how to avoid it. I don't think it's necessarily super hard or anything. I think I just am not really used to it. Oh, I thought for a second that was into the death. Oh, jeez, it's going horribly, horribly wrong. Oh, just kill me. <laughs> Did I lose that? Are you kidding? Oh. Oh no no I got it okay never mind. I thought I thought like it didn't collect it. So is it the same but just the other side? Yes yes it is. Hard to dodge. Ah oh, I tried to get out of there. It's not going well. I'm going to die. Let it be known. There is no health for me here. I'm going to die. Uh. Oh my gosh. Come on. No! Oh my god. Okay, we made it. We got out of it. Which way did you come from? That way. Okay, cool. Not sure where you were going. Oh, you could... Yeah, I knew this is the attack you were doing. Get out of there. No! Oh my god, get out of there! You're not making this easy! Platforms? Yes, platforms. Oh, thank you for the health, my sweet angel. I'll take that. Why we never give up. We're still in the game. I wish I was on that platform. <laughs> I know the attack I would want you to do. It's not this one. <laughs> the problem is, I have no measure of how close you are to death right now. There's probably some sort of tell, but I haven't worked it out yet. Because I'm too busy looking at everything else. There's, you may have noticed. Oh, there it is. There is that. Either that's the tell, or no, that's not the tell. We're still going. Uh. Oh no, we are done. Okay. That was rad. Oh hello. I'll take the blood gem. That was awesome. My blood gem. It's thirsty. The blood spilled by enemies will feed the gem. This gem will also allow me to improve my blood skills without limit. When it is full, I will be able to hold down uh, to consume it and regain health. I should heal myself before I get out of here. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh! I see. Hello, Hollow Knight. Yes. You do look familiar. So which is the way to go, left or right? So yeah, you can... Th this is very Hollow Knight, for sure. Okay, that's a way out. I don't want to go that way. I want to see what's left. I was wondering what that thing was, but yes. Makes sense, I guess. Oh, we're back here! Oh, that's cool. Okay, I like that. Right, we got a lot of money. If I really wanted to, I could go and buy something from the guy back in the main town. But I don't know if I want to. <laughs> I want to save my money and get something stupidly overpowered later on. Oh, hey! Escape from the Wasteland, quest complete. All right, you know what that means. Time to get more money. <laughs> You're damn right it is. 
That's 100% the best thing to do. So what's this one? Critical strike. And so, so what are, what are, wait, 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 yeah. You're going way up there. Why are you going way up there? Oh, because I've taken the central path, is that why? I don't know. Um, reduce dash, cool down time. Increases immunity time after being hit. Oh, that is good. Just challenging time with the cure. Mmm, I see. These stuff have unlocked because we've unlocked health stuff. Okay. Bloodshed by enemies. Oh, that would be really good. Yeah. The cost of your blood skills by 5% does not affect cure. Makes sense. Use a full heal or destructive... Upon a full heal, a destructive wave will damage them. Oh, wow. Okay. Upon receiving a hit, you can recover some spilled blood. Helpful. Magnet also attracts spilled blood. Ah, okay. When before my cure, if you have enough blood, you will recover 200. So that one. Damn. That's... It takes a while to get to that, doesn't it? <laughs> There's some really good stuff in the healing modes. The one I'm most interested in is that. That is super good. Um, but yeah, no, cool. All right. Can... Uh, no, I was going to say, can we swim? My guess is no. Like... <laughs> I, th I think we can all work out the answer. I think the next throne I find is where we'll end it for now. But I've really enjoyed this. This game's so good. Thank you everyone for watching. I hope you've been in, uh, enjoying this. Uh, if you have, I'd appreciate it if you left a like, subscribe, maybe share the video around. I also have a Twitch, a Twitter, and a Patreon if you'd like to support me in the channel. Um, but yeah, here is Rust. It's always gratifying to find one of my resurrected comrades. The fragments of my power are still far from the gr this graveyard. I'll have to cross it to continue. There. Yes, hello. Ooh, ooh, that's a comfy seat, isn't it? Um, that's that's very nice. Yeah, this game is great. If I look at the quests, can you see which one I've completed? Some fragments. Oh, okay, so I must find all the monoliths in this wasteland. I only found four of them. Okay. That's the first second path. That makes sense because I didn't have a double jump. There might be a new path down there. Okay, that makes sense. Cool. Um, so path the first fragment path is by here. It's also somewhere. See, I'm just trying to work out if there's any. Okay, so the green ones are done. These are secondary, and these are mains. Right, right, right. Okay, so it's also somewhere it's located in Famished Town. So I haven't done that. Play the ten twelve makes sense. Okay. Well, that's very cool for now. So, thank you for watching. Next time, we'll head through the graveyard. I guess. I'll see you then. Take care. Bye-bye.